Hi, I'm Lady. Johnny. Karen, Johnny, <laughs> how's it going? So what is this place? I've never been here before. So this is Brick Farm, which is um, a new restaurant we've set up, and this is the old Poplar Lanes, if yeah. you remember. So we've got a wee veggie and herd garden here, and it's all sort of based on fresh local produce and changing menu, and, and I've just been blown away by the response. People just love it. I, I had people down here helping me build the place, and I'd wasn't paying them or we ended up just buying heaps of fish and chips for lunch but people just wanted to come along and, and help and be a part of it and, and this is a that? private right. business you yeah, know? Yeah. Um, I think people are dying to be nice and do nice things and support each other and there's been a bit more of that since the earthquakes so of people um, how can we help and um, I, I, there's a much better energy around town and so this is uh, the downstairs of Brick Farm and no one will build this ever again. It makes no sense. It's a tiny little footprint, three stories high, and that's what I quite like about it. It's quirky and dysfunctional and weird and hard to work with. And What is exciting about Christchurch at the moment, you can do this daft stuff that you could never do before, and yeah. suddenly there's space about, there's mm. too much space about, and so you can do things like plant vegetable gardens in the city, and you, you couldn't do that in Auckland or Wellington because the real estate's too expensive, and mm. I think that's part of the excitement of the city. Thanks so much, man. Yeah. Like an awesome. awesome place. Yeah. Great. See you. See you again. Man, how amazing. It's so good to see uh, this kind of thing happening again in the Central City. It's so inspiring. And it was great to hear that people are coming in and helping out and want to be part of it, eh? Absolutely. And definitely Brick Farm. I'm definitely coming here in the weekend. <laughs> nice. Let's go. All right, cool.